Okay, tip of the week. I know you guys had fun playing with the uh, dinographs and moving them around and getting them to do different things. I'm just going to show you one more thing that you can do with them. Um, I believe, let me see if I can show the different functions. One of the things that you can do is you can take the input from this function and if you split it from its axis, you can actually merge it to the output of the first function. Doing this merge allows you to do composition of functions, which works out really kind of nice. Um, very simple to do. Again, we take this last one, we'll do a double composition here. I'm going to get this point, I'm going to split it from its axis, and I'm going to merge it to this point here. And of course, what I have now is a very nice composition of three three functions.